failure. Number two came at about the 10 year mark of my marriage. Now, you may have heard me shoot videos about how to succeed in marriage. Those lessons came hard learned. I came home one day, my wife was leaving with the kids. I was coming in, she said she was leaving. I said, good, I'll see you later. And she was serious. She had had enough. I was intending to the marriage, giving her what she needed so much, safety and certainty in a relationship. I was not doing that mentally, emotionally, physically for her, right? And she finally said, I gotta step up and I gotta protect the family because I was too busy at work. I had too many things going on from the morning to night, but I was bringing home the bread, right? How many of you get caught up in this? And one day they said, enough, Pat, I love you, but I'm not in love with this anymore. And it's time for us to go. You have three days to work this out, which basically was till Sunday night. And I had to make some big boy decisions. I was between a rock and a rock and a rock, right? And I had to make some big boy decisions. A couple of those rocks had to go. And here's the thing, when you're given an ultimatum, and you're being truthful with yourself, you go through this process where you finally get to your truth, right? And my truth was, yeah, I wasn't doing my part as a husband, as a father, and I had to make some big boy changes here. Suck down my ego, admit that, no, I dropped the ball here, and do everything I can do to win the favor of my wife and my kids back, because they deserve it. I may not deserve it yet, but they deserve it. Took, I'll be honest with you. You know, we think as, as guys, we think we can fix these things like a light switch and things could be better. I said, honey, what can I do to make this better now so we don't have to fight anymore? Didn't work that way. It took us two solid years for me to rebuild her trust in me that I was the guy, the alpha, the dad, the husband that she signed up with for her to wholly trust me again. Think about how painful that, that experience was. And you know what? Looking back on it as hindsight, I would not undo that experience because it allowed me to become the father, the husband that I was capable of becoming. Rise up guys, you don't have to go through that hell to learn that lesson. Take it from somebody who's been there, it's time for us to rise up.